Hurricane Sally has landed. Hey guys, welcome to a vlog. I wanted to show you guys what's going on and tell you. Okay, first of all, I was totally PMSing yesterday, crying, angry, the whole thing, and then I totally like popped a tire on Zach's car. So, <laughs> so we have to get two new tires, my luck. But let me show you what we're dealing with. Oh no, let me show you what we're dealing with. Lots of, lots of water. Um, so we're kind of dealing with a hurricane right now. It's getting really windy. Lots of rain, but it's not too bad. Like, I've had far worse hurricanes, but there's a body of water over there. But you can see, like, flooding is the major issue going on in this area. But luckily, there's low-lying places on the other side and behind us. But we're still having a lot of, like, water pooling doesn't help that the yard isn't finished um so yeah it's a mess but lots of rain and wind hey guys i'm in my bathroom and i thought i would talk to you guys for a minute i just put hair mask in so i put grande hair the rejuvenation serum in my hairline i'm just trying to keep it thicker because my hair is so fine that like you know even if there's a lot of hair there you can see my scalp so I'm trying to just like keep it thick and it seems to help a lot. I already have like little baby hairs coming in. A lot of it starts out blonde though which is weird because my hair is obviously brown. Um, but I also went ahead and put in my number three. I have not been using this enough so I also like to mix in a little bit of the number seven bonding oil which I use this all the time. Wet hair, dry hair, if I have any kind of like um frizziness coarseness if my ends look dry whatever it may be i use it a lot but i like to mix a little bit in and it's more hydrating so my hair is damp before i put these two in and then i like to use this drunk elephant comb and kind of like comb it through and really make sure that all the strands are getting coated so if you don't know like the number three will like strengthen and bond the hair together like i have a lot of damage my hair gets damaged super easily because it's so so fine and i'm still like wanting to go get some like color done um which obviously is going to damage it more so i'm just trying to take good care of it now and after i'm also going to put on the drunk elephant tlc sukari baby facial i had a few minis of this so i'm trying to use those up first but i just thought i would do some skincare last night i had a really nice little like pamper night and i felt like today i would do the same oh and i took my um diamonds out and cleaned those i'm not gonna put them back in until after i shower but i'm gonna let my old plex sit in my hair for a few hours while i edit a little update too like i was doing good with keto but um the longer i went into it the more digestive issues i was having it's like totally tmi but like a really really painful time going to the bathroom yeah it just got to the point where I was in so much pain and I was having so many issues that I had to like recognize that this was not working so as much as it pains me I had to take a break from it um, because I had one cheat day and I noticed that you know my, my issues were eased it's just a teensy teensy bit and I crave certain things that like are not that healthy but as I'm eating them, my stomach issues are getting better and like my bathroom issues are getting better. So I feel so stuck. Um, so I'm just trying to let things get back to normal and then, I don't know, every time I go on keto, um, the like issues that I'm having start to arise and for whatever reason, this time was way, way worse. Like I couldn't tolerate it. Um, so yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna have to do but it may be that you know maybe that's just not the best option for me so you know i may just have to like just be more sensible about what i eat and exercise more which is not a bad thing like i'm not complaining but i had to do something to change it up because i was in so much pain so anyway i'm doing a little pampering i am planning to go do my shopping on saturday today is thursday i don't think i mentioned that so today's kind of relaxing tomorrow i'm gonna film i hope you guys are doing amazing i'm gonna chill and edit today's video and that's about it my fingers are so sticky okay <laughs> i'll talk to you guys later oh goodness <laughs> hey guys so it is friday and i am <laughs> so disappointed to say that i have another ear infection i was really hoping yesterday that my left ear was a little achy and i was just hoping it was just like something brief but it's only been like a month like maybe a little bit over a month since i had an ear infection and 
it feels exactly the same I feel awful and it's in both ears now and I'm like what in the hell like I don't think ear inspection ear inspections <laughs> Ear infections are supposed to be very common in adults at all. I have something to eat today for lunch I'm really excited about. I look so puffy, right? Ugh. One of my favorite things is chicken salad chick, <laughs> um, which I don't, I don't think they're everywhere. I think they're more just in the south. But if you ever come across one and you like chicken salad, check it out. My favorite are Fruity Fan and Fancy Nancy. <laughs> So he got it for me and also got some grape salad, but this is my lunch and I'm so excited to eat it. And um, they gave me so many crackers, wheat thins. So I'm going to have that for lunch, but not right now. I'm going to have some coffee and wait a little while to eat. And I don't know, I'm just like praying that this aching in my ears will subside. And I'm also like feeling like dizzy, you know, with like that issue, which is common. So... I'm about to have some coffee right now, and yeah, I'm going to sit on the couch. <laughs> I don't feel like doing much else, and I'm going to put some of my drops in and try to chill. So that's it for now. I'm going to hydrate. I'm drinking lots of water, and then I'm going to have some coffee, and I'll talk to you guys later. So we're in between our TJ Maxx and Marshall's stops at Target. Hi guys, I have been doing a terrible job of vlogging, but a couple updates. I did my nails again with uh, Kiss Impressions nails. These are just so good, like they feel really, really sturdy. And I have been doing everything today. I have cleaned toilets, I have done it all. I have two packages ready to go. I won't show you addresses, but they're giveaway packages, so those are gonna be mailed out tomorrow. And I am going to um, gather some stuff up for another giveaway and do that soon. I already had an idea of some stuff, but I'm gonna add to it. I'm doing some cleaning and straightening and trying to put stuff away that is like lingering from moving that I haven't done yet. And I also wanna organize my palettes, but I also need to edit my video. So I probably will stop what I'm doing um, at around like four, which is an hour and a half and just focus on getting that video finished and edited so I can get it up tonight. I'm not gonna film today, I'm just trying to do other stuff. So I was gonna show you guys what I'm working on. I've been doing dishes, doing some cleaning. The bedroom's pretty much as is. I'm gonna film with all my TJ Maxx Marshalls Home Good stuff tomorrow. I feel like my vanities kinda come together. Last night I watched some Grays on Netflix. Hi Sally, you okay baby? Oh, her little eyes got watery again and it looks terrible it looks worse than it is but I've got little eye wipes for them oh I got more candles I don't think I showed you guys I ordered a few more um, that I hadn't already had a couple of these were online only I love these labels I posted this on Instagram stories I ordered pumpkin cookie dough sugar cherry crisp um, I think warm apple pie and then one other one that's um, sugared pecan smells really good but I love this one right now I'm burning pumpkin cupcake I feel like if you like a little sweetness and a little fall this is like the perfect fall candle I've got it in my little foxy holder I feel like I need another holder um, for maybe like my bathroom or other rooms so I'm gonna put some of this stuff up my little lighter from Amazon um, if you shop my Amazon list, this is like the best little lighter ever. I'll put this stuff up. Everybody has to have that random drawer of like tools, just, you know, just random stuff. So we do have, my parents brought us an extra mattress to use. We have some guests coming. 
Some of Zach's family is going to stay with us for a couple days. So I'm working in here and I think I'm going to put pallets here. I also do have a little bit of space left in these bottom drawers. I cleaned up some of my like boxes and stuff, broke down all the cardboard that I can recycle. I've got some trash here. I got Miss Pretty's Nias. You okay, baby? Yeah. See your notes? Oh, it's cool and moist. Awesome. I'm going to clean off my vanity. There's such a mess there. These are all the brushes that I need to clean. Kind of feeling like I need to deep clean, but I may just go for Cinema Secrets one more time. So I'm trying to get my living room a little bit more organized. I don't have all the furniture that we need to really get super organized, but I'm going to move these pallets so that they're like this just tons of pallets. Um, my bookcase is looking pretty good, but I need to kind of rearrange. I want to hang these up somewhere, but I'm not sure where and I don't want to commit unless I'm sure. And I kind of broke down some of my backdrop stuff. And then I may go through these bins right here because I have just like random stuff and see if I can consolidate. I do plan to order two more of these chairs and the matching table, but they come up on Zulily. I'm just waiting to see if they'll pop up there. It's not a necessity, but I am really ready to have a dining table and a couple more chairs. The nice thing is two of these chairs aren't that expensive, so I can get two more or four more. But yeah, hey, are you okay? No, oh, baby, what are we, I? And I don't know what I'm gonna do with this rug now, because it doesn't really go with our couch that we ordered and the coffee table situation. It just doesn't really go, but I may keep it here for underneath the dining table. What do you guys think? And it definitely feels like fall. I know this is a long clip, but it feels like a little bit like fall now. There's a breeze. It's not 98 degrees. I'm excited that it's getting better weather to be outside, like editing out here. And also when that bench is there, we'll have a couple more seats. Lots going on. So I feel pretty excited, but I'm going to go take care of more stuff inside and I'll talk to you guys later. Hi guys. It is now Friday and I'm probably not going to be vlogging this weekend. We have Zach's family members in the house. I'm doing a little decorating, but let me tell you guys, I'm so upset that my ring light stopped working and so i went ahead and ordered some light panels that i had been kind of like wanting to get for the longest but i still feel like i need a ring light for you know pictures and things like that it, and it's just such a beautiful light but i cannot find replacement bulbs that are less than like 60 or 70 dollars and i think i only paid like maybe 90 for that whole ring light so i'm trying to figure out what to do i found a diva light replacement bulb but it's sixty dollars and it doesn't fit perfectly in there so i'm like oh my god i hate that so let me show you though it's a little bit dark but i'm putting out some fall stuff like nothing too crazy just on top of the bookcase i put a couple things in here um this pumpkin and another little candle and an acorn which is cute i also filmed my tj maxx haul portion of my shop with me video or whatever i'm gonna call it and these trays i'm really excited to get this organized a little bit better but i already put two of them in here with um random little things little hair stuff i don't use this anymore i don't i don't know why i'm keeping it um little minis little travel stuff so that's what we're looking like so i'm gonna organize this drawer and i'll show you after all right, so here's what it looking like. I got my favorite deodorants, all my Capari and a native, um, some tools, hair, cleansing wipes, which I don't really use that often, but lips and then face, some little pill pads, face halos, a few lip balms, some mini skincare, and yeah, I like the way it looks. Everything's a little bit more organized. And I also have room right here if I needed to put like, I don't know, a bottle of something. Um, but I pushed them over here because these will kind of stay how I want them to. We still got a little bit of space, but not quite enough to fit another organizer. Like that would have been perfect, but this works out really well. I'm not mad at it. So that's what we're looking like. I think it looks pretty cute. Hey guys, so it is Monday. I need to take this mask off but I'm using the Australian pink clay mask from Sand and Sky. And I just have to say, I haven't used it in a while and I really like it, but I need to go take it off. Um, and I also just posted a couple things on Instagram. I'm trying out a new like, kind of like feel and vibe for my pictures, which is basically just like some different editing that I typically do. And I'm just testing it out. Let me know what you guys think about it, but I'm gonna taste this taste. <laughs> I'm gonna take this mask off and I'll be right back. 
All right, I finished up my skincare a little bit ago and then <laughs> forgot that I was talking to you guys. Um, but my skin feels really nice. This light is not the best. But I want to show you my fall decor. I don't think I showed you. Maybe I did. Maybe I'm crazy. So I put a couple things here on the counter. Just a little fall in the kitchen, not too much. And I have my candle. I have been now burning uh, pumpkin pecan waffles. This one is freaking amazing. I love this scent. And you can tell I've done some work. This was a new one a few days ago. So I've been burning it a lot. I'll probably light that here in a few minutes. I did put some stuff on top of this bookcase. I love this little, like, it reminds me of candy corn. But it's like a sweater material. It's got little sequins, but it's really cute. Um, this lights up, so I'll turn it on. And at night, it's just like a little hint of light. It's really cute. This is some cotton. I don't know when I bought that a while back. I put um, wine corks in here. I just thought it gave it like a different touch. Lots of textures. Um, this little pumpkin is a candle. I don't remember where I got this one. I think maybe from like the Hallmark store. It smells really good too. And then this my mom got me years ago. It's just like a little deer, but I put this with the hay. There's some little acorns in there, which kind of help keep it stable. And then we've got two more pumpkins. And then I've got this. I think I did show you guys this. It's got little bats in there and it actually plays music. Um, we've got skeleton Buddha, a couple different textures of pumpkins here, and then I made this section the open part because we've got um, like our actual our stuff that we use here, and then we've got another <laughs> candle that's an owl, a couple little different pumpkins. This pumpkin jar doesn't have anything in it, but it's really cute. So that would be cute in the kitchen too. And then some of my newest fall candles and I like the labels. So I put all of those there and I just felt like kind of pulled that together and looks cute. So I've now ordered um, my panel lights like I told you guys and I did finally order a Diva ring light. Um, I already have a tripod so I just found a ring light that's just the assembly for the light without the tripod so I don't buy more than I need. I feel weird like I, I can't really just sit down and film like I want to I can try filming with natural light obviously um and sometimes here that works but sometimes not so maybe tomorrow I'll pull it together and film but for today I'm gonna start editing this vlog so I hope you guys enjoyed it I don't really even remember half of what I did because so much of my vlogging was for the other video with the shopping which I hope you guys liked I think it turned out really cute I like the idea but if you haven't seen it I'll go Go ahead and stick that guy right up here um, but it's my like shop with me at Marshall's Home Goods TJ Maxx and I also included the polls so yeah that was really fun and that's it for now so I hope you guys are doing amazing and I will see you very soon in my next one thanks for watching guys